Oh, well, my name is Fox Knight, so big name with Fox, and I just finished watching the latest episode of Legends of Tomorrow. Well, not actually, it's not the latest. Um, it's second latest because the latest one I haven't seen yet. But I've seen yeah, the next episode after twenty forty six, and um, and uh, this was Marooned, where the gang basically gets they basically try to help these one this other time time lord time master out. And because they need to, they need to update their computer systems, and they can only do that by getting the system from this other Time Master's ship. So they're saying, all right, we can help this marooned ship out. That way, we can then just take the thing from there. But turns out there are pirates, time pirates. Which at first I thought, like, okay, how the fudge are there time pirates? But I but I, I first assumed, well, okay, maybe a rogue uh, time master could give the time traveling technology or whatnot. But so far that wasn't so much explained other than they're just time pirates. And there's a bunch of Star Wars references. Um the Rory, the guy with the fire gun, uh he's still angry at Snark. There's a lot of people are fighting. Um the pirates at one point shoot the ship that only had uh, Captain Cold, White Canary, and Hot Girl, Hot Girl a Adam on it. Um, while the others were on the pirate ship, um, they got captured on the pirate ship. So, battle breaks out, war, fight. Well, they fight each other and stuff like that. At one point, uh, Rory, the fire gun dude, he basically betrays the team. Well, after rip after because rip and him were like at each other's throats and rip said i didn't even watch you on one um the fire guy um rory said well you asked me to be on this team to kill punch or burn right and rip said no i didn't watch you on my team all i want i only i your it was just that you and your partner were double package and showing that one he didn't want rory on the team but he only wanted captain cold so i'm like dang it you idiot you shouldn't have said that Rory basically betrays them so that they could fight, so they could fight um, so that um, Rory was a Trojan horse and let the other pirates onto the Wave Rider. Um, battles ensue. Battles ensue. Also, like um, Captain Cold and White Canary were stuck in a lock where there was the breach for the ship that it got shot, the Wave Rider. So they were slowly dying. Adam had to go outside the breach to seal it, but his suit was running out of air, but he luckily got back and was brought back to life by from cardiac arrest by Hawko beating him in the chest saying he, she loves him. Um, and then it, basically they get the pirate ship back, whatever. We get a little bit of um, rips past about like his wife used to be a time master, pretty good one, but then uh she quit when um they when the time masters found out and she said she said he did it because she wanted love and if you're a time master i guess you can't have love because jedi <laughs> i don't know um oh but yeah and also the ship can go into space which i kind of guessed that the time the wave rider i kind of guessed it could go into space and basically, because they're both time machine, the two both time master ships, the Wave Rider and the other one that uh, they were boarding, all they really needed to do to make it seem like, oh, this is the pirate ship, was have all the blue lights, red, have all the red lights blue in the pirate ship, and then have all the red lights red on Wave Rider. So that was kind of a cool thing. Yeah, it's the first season, so the budget's going to be kind of small until next season where then they'll be able to you know vamp it up a bit more but wasn't it's not it's not bad like there were some funny moments um they like what 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 did they have they referenced they referenced back to the future with the doctor going great scott uh star wars um what's his name the adam the adam at one point he's he's put in charge of the wave rider he, as captain, so he sits in the chair and goes, Captain's log. So, Kirk, and then he says, and then um, Hawker was like, I think you're more Picard than Kirk. And then he says, Zulu, and then at one point he said he was Han Solo. So, yeah, they're just, they're just like, screw it, we're gonna make as many references to sci-fi things as I can, as we can. Um, but basically, in the end, pirates get sucked out by, get sucked out of the ship by this maneuver that, um, 
by this maneuver that uh what's his name well on the pirate ship the pirates get sucked out by um a maneuver that rip learned from his wife that was shown in a flashback which i kind of guess okay that's right how they're gonna get rid of him and then uh rory got captured on you know the wave rider by his by uh captain cold and everyone the pirates got kicked out of that uh the pirates that I, Captain Cold then has, then they're all trying to debate what they have to, what are they going to do with Rory, and Captain and Captain Cold says, "I'll handle it." So I'll handle it. So they go to the past because they said that, well, we could drop them off back at um, 2016, but they said if we do that, um, if we do that, Rory's going to go after my sister or your sister or all our family, so we can't let that happen. So Captain Cold basically takes him down to the forest at some point in time. I don't know when. And Rory's like, you, well, only one of us is going to get out of here, so you better kill me. And Captain Cold basically, he doesn't say it, but it's like, look at the flowers, Rory. And he takes out his eyes, going to shoot, shoot um, Rory off screen. So Rory might return. And it's actually pretty sad. You get a little bit of backstory that Rory saved Snark when, he was, um, when they were in Juvie. The, when Snark was in Juvie the first time, they've been stuck together ever since. And it's kind of, that's it's it's like it's kind of sad seeing like oh now that's that's broken but I I hope he's not dead because one he's a um Roy was a, is an awesome character I hope Snark just like froze his feet or something and also like Rory said I guess it's probably just so that like if he does kill him if he did kill him I don't know if he dropped Rory off at 2016. <sighs> Just so that um, Snark can come back and give him a proper burial at some point, or if like they just went to the past, so they just it was a forest area, so we don't know when this was. Something heck for all you all you, for all you needed to do was drop this guy off in the past and just leave him there for a time being, or throw him in like a I don't know some kind of some kind of medieval cell in the past and just leave him there till you guys come back which even then you just drop you just need to drop him off for a second because you drop him off you leave you go on your entire adventures then assuming you don't die you come back as you put punch in the time to come back a second later pick him back up again done and done or you know lock him in a sleep capsule or something i don't know it's real quick the way that they could do this but yeah and now we're minus Rory, and then they just, they all go back, they're going on the Wave Rider, and then, like, that was the end of the episode, um, Captain Cold shooting Rory off screen, so he's probably not dead. But, yeah, fun episode, not too bad. Um, I kind of guess, you know, the whole being sucked out of the ship thing, the maneuver was, that I was shown in the flashback was going to be used again now, but it was not too bad. Also, they got the little thing that, so that they know where Randall Savage is, and so now they're going to go to 19... 50 something so they're gonna go back to the 50s now when there's nuclear bombs and all that jazz well there's still nuclear bombs but you know what i mean but doesn't look too bad um i'm gonna i'm gonna watch the next episode in a bit but you know pretty good thank you all so much for watching thank you all so for what tell me what you guys liked about this um thank you all so much for watching please check out all the videos thank you everyone and pretty fun episode but thank you all so much for watching and i'm trying to I'm, probably, I'm trying to make well that episode i probably is a lot easier to do because it's a lot shorter but it was pretty cool, especially since um, the professor had some cool moments where he knocked a, where a pirate came in, he knocked the pirate out, and then walks he, he knocked the pirate off a pirate out off screen, and he walks back with the beret on and a gun in hand. I'm like, that's awesome! But it was pretty fun. Um, this is a it was really not much to the thing other than you know pirates and all that stuff, and then you know the whole love thing with the Time Lord saying, oh, you can't love, and stuff like that, but either way, pretty good episode, pretty short plot I could really, uh, you know, summarize right now, but either way, thank you all so much for watching, please check out all my videos, um, tell me what you guys thought about the episode, and we will. See you later.